Hey everybody, it's me, Nathan Rich, aka the guy who loves hot pot. I'm here in Chaoyang Park in Beijing, just kind of relaxing. It's、uh, kind of a nice temperature. It was very, very hot today, but now it's cooled off quite a bit. And、uh, I haven't made videos in a while, and I just wanted to kind of let everybody know what's been going on. I basically just got burned out. Most people don't realize this, but I actually do all of the production myself. So I do the filming, the editing, the、um, subtitles were being done by my girlfriend, and、uh, the logo, the audio editing, finding the music, everything, the uploading, all that stuff. Um, so recently, I started paying somebody to help with the translation and the subtitles,、um, and I've still been doing the transcription and fixing the English and the filming and the editing and all this stuff. So、uh, it's just been too much work, basically. I think I'm going to discuss in another video sort of what it's like to have this this channel. What are the pros and cons of it? But it doesn't really do anything for me personally. The money that it makes is not enough to even hire a small team. And so、um, I've just been doing it myself, but I've decided that rather than do that, because I've just I just burn myself out again and again. Rather than doing that, I'm going to just spend the, all the money that comes from it on getting a team and spend my own money on top of that, and just get the people that I need and stop doing all of the. Um, production work myself, so that's a change to the channel, and I've been working on doing that in the last couple of weeks. So I have somebody to help me with the translation. I have somebody to help me with the editing,、um, and I'm changing the way that some of the production works so that it should be a little bit easier for me.、Um, but it's going to cost more money. This project that I'm doing needs to make enough money to support itself. I've been supporting it my, for a year and a half now, putting all the money in, making all the videos, doing everything, and、um, doing it at a loss—a loss of time and a loss of money. And I've been doing it because I think that the message is important, and I think that somebody has to be challenging this strange narrative that you see from the far right and even from some parts. To the left these days,、um, and I just really haven't personally found an avenue to get this type of information.、Um, so I started doing it myself. Only about 0.0005 percent of my subscribers actually contribute to me monthly. Personally, I really enjoy talking about political things. I think that philosophy and politics, geopolitics, especially in relation to China, are the number one most important topic in the world right now. But I'm not going to just continue to sacrifice myself to this cause for no reason. Just in this month or so that I've been on this break and trying to sort things out, I've already lost at least 25% of the donors. This thing is not set up to. Make money, but it's not intentionally set up to lose money either, and that's all it's doing now. It's just sucking away my time and my my money. Most people don't really know that I do all the work, but I have been doing all the work for a very, very long time, and I'm just burnt out. What have I been doing? I've been exercising, learning Chinese, sitting on my couch, relaxing, going to work, being a normal person, and.、Um, And you know, there's much, much more money in my life coming from investments and work than this channel will ever provide, and、uh, and that's fine.、Uh, I, I don't need money from this channel, but this channel needs to support itself. Otherwise, it's just this strange, masochistic, self-sacrificing cause that doesn't need to be. I mean, the people that I'm. Confronting about their lies and their mistruths, they're not doing this. They have backers, they have advertisers, they have、uh, you know a lot of people donating to them. A very high percent of their their viewers. Their message is so popular and such a boring mainstream, run of the mill、um, attitude of of contributing to to global hatred and and. 
um, in supporting this anti-Chinese message. It's such a popular thing to do these days in some circles that they can find advertising no problem. Personally, I prefer to keep the channel as it is and have more donors because that means that I can uh, continue to be totally independent and just say things that are from me. And you know, I don't care if some laundry detergent brand doesn't like what I have to say, you know? Looking through the comments, I have noticed a lot of people are wondering what happened to me and, and you know, a lot of uh, supporters have abandoned me and um, that's fine. But I feel like I just kind of owe people some explanation. I mean, I just disappeared. So yeah, that's it. I mean, this, this channel is just, was started by me to kind of fight back against some of the stuff that I saw. I have no allegiance to anyone. I have, I don't owe anybody anything. Um, I'm not run by anybody. Nobody backs this channel. I just do everything myself. It's a lot of work, as anybody in media production can tell you. What I actually want to build is an organization that's independent, that can actually challenge these ridiculous claims and um, assertions that people with education and credentials so haphazardly sling across the ocean at China, and I can't do it alone. And I won't do it alone, frankly, even if I could, because it's unfair, and I want everybody to join in on this. I want everybody behind this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to just releasing videos how I always was. Whatever subject comes up, that's what we're going to talk about. If you want it to stay that way, if you want to see Epic China and you want me to talk about controversial things um, as well as other things, then you'll have to basically go to Patreon or Subscribestar or PayPal or my WeChat public account and you'll have to kind of say, hey, I need to support this guy. If enough of you guys do that, then I'll have a, a small team to help me. And so I can focus on getting more videos or videos with better content, or I'll still have to do the research and that kind of stuff. Um, so that's option one. If we go to the second option, where I feel like there's just not enough momentum for me to hire people to take care of what needs to be done, then I'm going to have to start moving away from controversial subjects. And if a rioter set someone on fire or stones someone to death, I may not even be able to bring it up because I might have to worry about what Coca-Cola thinks about it or, you know, that kind of thing. And that's going to be very stressful for me because I don't like having to mold my videos after what somebody wants me to say. So, not dead, <laughs> not kidnapped. Uh, life is pretty good here in, in Beijing. I'd love to tell you about the situation with COVID-19. I'd love to talk about the racial issues in my country. So if you do want to see more videos from me with good research, well thought out and, you know, solid points with evidence and um, pretty strong arguments, I think, then I have to pay these people. So you guys are going to help me with that or advertisers will help me with that. I have some subscribers who have helped me and continue to help me. And those guys are great. You know, th those people are keeping the hope alive that, hey, maybe those people who watch this channel will also think that this is kind of a unique and different offering that I'm, that I, that I provide, you know, it's, it's, it's totally real. People who meet me in person find out really quickly that I am exactly who I say I am in every way. Right, they want to talk technology, let's do it. You want to talk about VFX, let's do it. You want to talk about China, geopolitics, what do I think about this? Oh, but what about this gotcha thing? Well, I have thought about that. Let's talk about it. Let's get into it. So, you know, the videos are coming from me. They're not coming from anyone else. And they're coming from me. What I'm talking about is having a channel that can pay for itself. I don't even care if it profits. Just, I can have a team and I don't have to lose my own money for it. You know what I mean? And I don't think that that's too much to ask for. And if it is too much to ask for, then like I said, that's fine. I, I'm not upset about it. It's just, you know, it's disappointing, but we can figure out another way. And that other way is gonna be, um, 
you know, ad banners and <laughs> Instead of a band t-shirt, I'll have a, uh, you know, some sponsored t-shirt and I'll be talking and I'll say, but you know what's even better than that? This brand of drink, mmm, you know, or something like that. I don't know. Um, we'll figure something out, but it will almost certainly mean I'll have to talk less about racy, controversial types of issues, or at least the most extreme issues. I won't be burnt out because I have other people helping me, but the new problem will be how long will I continue to just spend my own money on them even though I get millions and millions and millions of views on my videos uh, you know and the answer to that is not long so again if you want to help this channel remain how it is then you can go to my patreon or subscribe star which are monthly donation sites or you can go to my WeChat public and you can basically donate at any time so still very much alive still very much in China still Still loving it here, still having a great time, still seeing lots of Chinese people who very, very much care about their children. I'd love to continue to make videos for everybody. I've got some lined up. I'm going to do them with this new process and see how it goes. So if you want to help me raise my 0.0005% of my subscribers who actually contribute to this channel monthly to 0.1% <laughs> point oh one percent which would be a huge jump then you know nobody's stopping you now's the time because i'm rallying everybody we're doing this me and my very small team we're going to be making videos like crazy and uh hopefully i don't have to go to the advertising model because i don't want to do it anyway look forward to some new videos from me soon i have a lot of them planned some of them are already almost done and uh so i'm back thanks everybody Shit, yeah.